Hello everyone, this is Mark with MrHurricaneTracker.Webs.com. We've got two actual storms to look at. The first one is the Subtropical Storm Sean. Right now we're taking a look at Subtropical Storm Sean. Today is November 8, 2011. Current time is 9.48 a.m. Central Daylight Time. Tropical Storm Sean actually came off the southeast of the United States and went into the water and was able to tap into that warm water and actually become a subtropical storm. So it's not really much to worry about for the east coast of the U.S. The east coast of the U.S. is pretty much in the all clear, except for maybe Bermuda. And of course, I'll continue to keep you posted on that and what's going to happen. Now, the storm may actually gain strength. It may not. I'll continue to keep you posted over the uh, course of the next couple of days. We're, this is warning number one from the National Hurricane Center as of 900, 0900 GMT. Position is 27.2 degrees north. If you're tracking it with us here in Mr. Hurricane Tracker, the 27.2 degrees north and 69.4 degrees west. Location 445 miles southwest of Bermuda. Movement right now is stationary, so it's pretty much sitting there right now and is actually probably gaining strength as we speak. So we'll have to watch this. Again, this is very unique to have tropical storm activity this time of year. So we're taking a look at it and the maximum sustained winds are about 40 to 50 knots, uh, are actually 40 to 50 miles per hour. Winds uh, in the area of the center are probably about 34 um, knots. And again, of course, I'll continue to keep you posted. Now, right now there is no threat to any land mass at this time, but we will have to watch Bermuda very close. And of course, the states of the eastern seaboard but right now it looks like everybody is in the all clear so guys keep in mind everybody looks like they're in the all clear we've got storms here in the midwest going down from texas all the way up and of course i'll continue to keep you posted on that because we still have problems with people in connecticut where there are still people over 300,000 people still without power and may still be without power throughout the week i'll continue to keep you posted on all of this breaking news and as of course I'll continue to keep you updated with everything as much as it comes in with the earthquakes. Now I'd like to do an earthquake update probably later on today or tonight when I get back from work. So again, thanks for watching guys. Please rate, subscribe, and comment. I'll continue to keep you posted on this breaking news with of course our subtropical storm that's out here in, in this area. And of course I'll continue to keep you posted the very, very interesting news and updates. Thanks for watching and have a great day.